Hello guys, welcome to Exam List and in this video, we'll talk about what you need to do after getting admission in IIT through JAM. Okay, so before continuing this video, let me tell you that Exam List is providing uh, IIT JAM physics materials. Um, you can go to our uh, YouTube channel or you can visit our Facebook page to know more about the IIT JAM physics materials. So let us start this video um, with what you need to do. First and the most important thing is make a passport. Why? Because uh, after two years, maybe in between, you may think of uh, doing a PhD in abroad, you need a passport there. But uh, the most important thing is the moment you get your admission in June, July, there will be a one month winter break during December. So you have five months in your hands. And in that one month break, uh, you, if possible, go for an internship abroad. Okay, so um, you need to search for opp opportunities of the university about the universities that are providing the uh, one month internship or you can also go at your own cost um, if you can afford uh, mail the professors in IITs or IISCs and ask them for a one month uh, internship program and do the internship. Okay, because that is most important. It will add to your CV. Next is focus on your grades and your knowledge. Yes, unfortunately, you have to focus on grade and expand your knowledge simultaneously. Okay, so it's not like uh, get bad grades and be very knowledgeous or be less knowledgeous or get good grades. Uh, don't uh, be that combination because anyway, you will suffer. You have to be good in your grades. You have to be good at your knowledge. So sometimes in some of the classes, you might feel like the professor is giving mark where you have to write things that he taught. Do that don't just uh, write anything else okay in rare cases it might happen but uh, in most of the cases you will have good prof to interact with they'll teach you a lot of things uh, starting from basic concepts to your msc concepts you will you learn a lot of things okay but uh, know how to maintain the grades you, sh you should know the strategy ask your seniors how to maintain the grades okay and then the grades will not only really help in your future. For example, after MS, you want to go for a job, the grades will help. Or if you want to do a PhD abroad, the grades will help. If you want to do a PhD in India, you have to give net JRF. Good grades, good knowledge will surely help you to clear this exam. Okay, so focus on your grades and knowledge. So give equal importance to your grades and your knowledge. So be clear in your concept. So PhD is not a place where you learn. PhD, PhD is a platform where you need to do research, you need to work. So before that, just be good with your knowledge. Okay, so you, you must be clear with your concepts. Do well in your MSc project. Yes, so um, you must take this point very seriously because if you will apply for a PhD in abroad, then most of the professors, they will see what you have done in your MSc project. Only then you will get admission if the professor agrees. So. You need to mail the professors a research statement um, where you need to write uh, what kind of research you would like to perform and uh, what will be your future aim uh, in research. So to write the research proposal, the most important thing that will help you is your MSc project. It will give you an idea about the recent work that's going on and you can uh, write your research proposal based on the MSc project. So it's better you decide your topic from the very beginning. For example, you are going into the MSc, just if you want to do a, uh, for example, if you want to do a PhD in astronomy after two years, so go for the internships in astronomy and go for a MSc project also in astronomy. So it's better you plan a way ahead, okay, because this is not the time that you plan today and do that tomorrow. That time is gone. You need to plan everything ahead of time. So um, the next tip will be, yes, you will face a hectic time schedule the moment you wake up you have to run for classes you have to run for lab you have to do assignments at the night and then you'll get very less time to sleep okay this is going to happen because uh, even if you complete your assignments in time the friends will not gonna leave you so you will have any kind of disturbance uh, enjoying with your friends and all that that's good you know so uh, spend some time with friends there so you have you'll meet friends from all over India with many cultures many thinking processes amazing things so um, that's a very good experience that you're going to uh, get in the IITs yes talk with your professors and your seniors take some information 
why talk with your professors because uh, in if you apply for a phd somewhere you might need recommendation letter in some institute so they will help you with this only if you have good terms with the professor and second you'll get extra information from your seniors so do uh, have a good um, relation with your seniors so talk to them um, uh, be a good junior whatever you like but do have good contact with the seniors yeah you'll get a lot of friends keep all your friends contact with you because uh, you might get help anytime you want okay so um you'll get good friends there yeah you'll meet some genius minds there so don't feel jealous everybody has their own uh, interest so you'll meet some genius mind there so once you meet them you'll understand what type of people are there who are interested in studies who are really interested in research so for most of the people uh, getting a jrf means getting 25000 per month so getting a job is not like that so phd is not a platform where you should think about earning money it's all about doing good research so you'll find people who have a deep interest in research already from a young age and they're doing a lot of things way ahead of you and you'll meet them and i hope they inspire you to do something good in life and then this will be the tip uh, for all those who are getting into IIT. i won't expand anything on this and yes the time spent in IIT might change your life so good luck all of you okay so um for all those students who have not cleared jam or those who are uh, in the process of giving this jam exam uh, please visit our website you'll get materials uh, go to our youtube channel you'll get videos currently we are giving only physics videos so good luck with that thank you for listening bye bye